make your home, and I know you do business all over DFW, or really Dallas mostly, Yes. but uh, but I know you really kind of focus and you have got a special niche in the Park City's Preston Hollow area, right? Correct. So what made you, because let me be honest, you know, most of the agents in that space are just more seasoned. They're just a little bit older, frankly, right? And they, because they... Uh, feel like they've kind of made their stake there, and it's a very protected area. So it's hard to break into that. So what made you decide to go after such a difficult area? Well, it's just where a lot of the business took me in terms of, it really started with builders. Uh, builders, when they start getting back in the market, felt most comfortable in the park cities, and I aligned myself with a couple of builders. Mm. And it really went from a emotional purchase to really people looking at it as an investment. Right. And so I kind of looked at it, excuse me, as that, and ran numbers based on investment and price per square foot to the dirt, construction costs, et cetera, and established credibility with knowing that particular side of the business. And so that's how I broke into it. So what's going on out there right now? And in Dallas as a whole, but especially in the Park Cities area, because there's there's not a lot of you can't get dirt over there, first of all, and it is a hard area to get into. So what, what are you seeing out there? Well, you're seeing a very little inventory. So yeah. a serious lack of inventory and a serious need to be in the park cities for the schools. And that's what drives the park cities is, is the, uh, the, the great schools. And it's, you know, a limited area. So there is not a ton of real estate over there. And uh, what you need to do is jump on something. If you see something and it's priced right, you need to be ready, lender ready, whether it's lender, cash, et cetera, but ready to make a move on it. Because if you don't, the next person will. So you need to be tied into the market, and then you need to be you need to feel comfortable. So I always tell my clients, let's go look at property so that when it does hit, you're ready to make the move. Because you may trust me, but at the end of the day, you're making that final decision.